đến đó là bây giờ tôi uh, lòng pháp sơn nam sơn chợ đó là trong cái này nói ở bên hông เออนุนนะเนี่ยเปตตอตัวมูกันดานะจานาศึกษาเปตเปตเปตเปตตัวมูใช้ว่าเนี่ยเนาะเปตเปตตัวมูใช้ว่าอีกขอเปียมูทด
ไปเตะมอเตอร์ชินะเปตาตอมอตอนนะไปจอดไปเฉลยมอเตอร์ชินะอีเปียเตียเปมอเอ่อใช้เป็นลงพัสนามเตอร์ชินะกูไม่ได
the rotometer will bre break it to small uh, particles and they make the soil uh, soft. Actually, this is the last uh, activation of the field preparation before we planting. We, after we, we mark the, 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 the beds, we rotate the beds only and the, the beds will be fine and soft. We'll see how it, it goes. Any question about it? If not, let's continue. Which one that you know, you can check out here. Yes, this one is a little bit, you cannot see, but this one is a <laughs> wheat cleaner. It's cutting the weeds not inside the field, around the field. Here we have the engine, the mechanical engine. This part is connected to the back of the tractor. When the back of the tractor rolling, it's uh, rolling this way. And underneath here we have a chain that turbulating very fast and cutting all the weeds that are underneath this. Uh, we do it not inside the field, but surrounding the field of if we have an orchard between the rows, we use this one to cut the weeds. Uh, and cut it very close to the surface, so we do not develop again. Okay, it's not important, this is a roof of tractor. <laughs> yeah. Okay. More or less, it's not exactly flower, it's called pre-flower. Why it's pre-flower? When we are going to uh, cultivate a new field, like, for example, the, the way, the, way the, the soil is very hard. It's very hard and the flower cannot go inside it and, and, and break it and do what it needs. So before plowing, using this and this one just making some all to break the, 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 the soil so after that we can go with the plow very easy <laughs> we don't do it every cultivation but usually the first time that we plow uh, we plow a field that it never was uh, cultivated before or after many years that uh, the, uh, every year it's a uh, compost more and more until it's too hard and the plow cannot go inside, we use this pre plower. Prime power. What does it mean prime power? <laughs> this one is is the same idea of the rotovator but it's working different way but it's rotometer that we carry that make the soil much much softer also here we can see from the other side uh, there are some metal knives and when we roll it and, and there is an engine that make it roll very fast uh, it will cut cut the, the, the weeds and also um, break the clothes this way, like I do by hand, but do it very fast and we'll get very soft uh, soil after this water uh, This This one This tool is very simple. You can see it's connected to the tractor there, and this is a kind of knife that going on the field and cutting all the weeds that are on the surface. This go on the surface of the soil, of the, and it's cutting all the, the weeds. And, and also, if we growing animals and we 
go for them some uh, alfalfa or other grass. We use it to cut the grass to bring it to the animals to eat. Uh, like knife that cutting the wood. <laughs> Sewing machine to sew, for example, cereals, uh, wheat, uh, corn, uh, if rice, if you want, uh, all what we're doing, we, we put in the seeds, and the seeds are going here. We have a flow. A uh, plate that will uh, release the seeds by, by one by one, every five centimeters, every seven. We can adjust it as depends what we are planning. planting. <coughs> and you see it's go by the the pipe down. In the, down there are two, two knives that open a, a, open a, a ditch. They put the seeds and after that this, this one will cover the, the ditch and they cover the seeds. The dip uh, of the, it's about three, four, five centimeters. And it's the best way to plant. It's small plant, planter. They are much bigger for big uh, farms, but uh, he, uh, because it's a, a small farm, a moshar, and not a kibbutz, they don't need a big machine. Uh, if, if we go to kibbutz, we'll see something 12 meters wide or something like this. This plant, one, two, three. Three lines, yes, three lines, three rows. And this, by this uh, endos, they can adjust the plant, the, the plant with holes to decide the distance of the ceiling. And also this, it go by the tractor from here. After we prepare the field, in this, when we planting the cereals, we don't have to make beds. We planting on flat, and we go with this every three hours. We plant seeds. <laughs> You can see, yes. Okay, but it's not. It's not a plower. It's almost the same. The one that we saw at the beginning. This is marking the beds. You see, here will be the ditch between the beds. Here will be other ditch. This will be leveled a little bit, and here is the bed. After we. Making the bed, we can plant on top of bed. We put the, the, the irrigation. We'll see later, and we plant. Now we can adjust the size of the bed if we want to make it. This is about, I think, two meter, one point eight meter. We can bring this to here and to here, and to make bed of one meter. Depends what we are going to plant. We can adjust the edges of the bed. Very simple. <laughs> okay, what is this? <laughs> and I look. Okay, this is a tank of the prayer. This prayer also goes beyond the tractor, connected by this to the uh, part, part, power takeoff of the tractor, and. When it's uh, 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 working, it's making some pressure inside the tank. We can adjust the, the pressure here by opening and closing this and this. And on the back of it, sometimes we find boom, and we call it boom spiral. And the boom is a long uh, 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 metal pipe with... Uh, nozzles that will spray, but here 
They sprained by. Sprained by. Uh, by this. By this hose. You can see this hose is can, it's about 50 meter long. They have this. They can adjust it. How much uh, spray will come from here? Outside. And they go and spray in the field. A tractor goes by driver and one of the workers follow the tractor by foot and spray the field and it can go inside the rows, uh, inside the greenhouse, the tractor wait outside, it had long enough holes to go inside the out. The tractor cannot go inside the, the, the greenhouse or the tunnel, so he's standing outside uh, operating the, the, the spray and the worker goes inside the greenhouse and spraying this way all the weeds or the crop, uh, insecticide, fungicide, herbicide, depends. Usually we don't use the same spray for herbicide and uh, pesticides, fungicide and uh, because the, what the left, the, what they remain inside the pump and inside the drive can cause damage if we put herbicide and then uh, uh, we, we spray the, air, the, the, the wheat and then we put fungicide and spray the lettuce, for example. What left from the herbicide inside and always something left and uh, in the engine, in the pump, in the pipe, it can <laughs> cause damage to the lettuce. So usually we need at least two sprayers, one for herbicide, one for fungicide. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Excuse me? Yeah. Um, how does it work with the person spraying? Does the person spraying go before the tractor or the tractor before? No, the, the tractor go before. If if we are, if it's outside in the field, the tractor go before, and you go following. Okay. If you if you go inside the greenhouse, the tractor stand on the uh, outside. outside, and you go inside. And okay, that means the hose pipe should be long enough to. Access yes, the yes, it's supposed to be long enough. Usually, uh, the the standard pipe is about 50 meters, and usually the greenhouses are. 30 meter. Sometimes if we have something like this that it's 70 meter, we start from here, finish, go from the other side and do it again so we uh, fill, spray all the, the greenhouse. We can, we can use a longer pipe, but if we'll take a 100 meter pipe, a hose, it will be very heavy and very inconvenient to walk in the field. The normal, the standard, the, the easy way to work is by 50 meter uh, hose. Uh, mostly is, is, is good for most fields. In, okay? Okay. Go on. It's difficult to see, but. Can you guess what this machine is doing? You know? Uh, not exactly, you are close. You see, what, what we have is just uh, two knives in the, in the beginning, two uh, metal uh, pipes, and this going down, and these two uh, pieces of metal. Okay, May I believe that you will not guess, so I help you. Mulching by polyethylene, by plastic. They put the whole of the plastic here, they put the two, two different mulches. First, they put the first one, the one that going on the floor, we'll see later, put it here. And for low tunnels, they use the 
the arms of metal, you remember? And, and this, the, 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 top, the top plastic goes here, and they take the plastic here. This one goes on the floor and stepping on the plastic. So it's stretch it and uh, bring it to the right position. And this two cover the plastic by, uh, by the soil, so it will hold it very nice. And uh, every bag, one, one, uh, one uh, <coughs> very simple machine and very helpful. Okay. เป็นมุสัยเปอร์อาบินะนะปาบินะยาเลฮูจะปุยมักนะนะปุยมักเลยเอาฟุ้นบุ้มนะนะเห็นนะเพจะรอเชซีอยู่หาดิจันนี่น
compost, it means it's not ready yet because the flies, the insects, uh, please come, come a little bit. Uh, That the process is not finished yet and there are some some insects living on this area uh, when it finished the process we will not see any flies on the top of the heap and if we we'll touch it it will be soft and fine well, not like the manure it's like a compost and this is very good to use as organic material to mix with the soil for one, and secondly, it contains manuals to feed the plants. And for example, if you grow it organic, what you call organic uh, crops, that like this farm, this are not using uh, 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 chemicals to feed the plants. They feed them the compost. They put a lot of compost. Indeed, the compost is not contains so much uh, minerals, but it contains, for example, uh, uh, in general, about five, six percent of nitrogen, about two or three percent of uh, phosphorus and uh, potassium and uh, calcium and magnesium and other minerals. And it's very good to use, first of all, when you prepare the field. We put compost to mix the, make the soil uh, rich with organic material that it's very good start for the new plants. And secondly, we use it to fertilize during the cropping by sp spread it on the field or uh, suck it with water and put it with the irrigation system. And it's very simple to prepare uh, compost. There are many, uh, many kinds of compost, depends what you want to do. Usually, what you do, how you make the compost, you take manure, let's say amount of manure, let's say 100 kilo of manure, you add to it another 100 kilo of uh, chicken shit, because it contains different minerals and uh, and you add to it uh, dry dry uh, leaves dry uh, weeds any any uh, vegetative material organic material and you put this one two three four layers depends and you let it uh, spray some water on top of it and let it start work. Uh, in the winter time it's better if you will cover it by plastic to keep the warm inside better because you know any uh, biological process, any chemical process that you heat it, it goes much faster. After a month or two you turn it over, the bottom will be top, the top will be in the bottom and after, again uh, let it uh, some water, cover it another two months and it's ready. In the winter time you don't have to put water because the rain's doing the dough very well but you have from time to time to come and to turn it over so all the compost will be uniform in the same process more or less because you know that the temperature in the top is not the same that in the bottom, so it's better to turn it over and to bring the top to the bottom to have some more temperature than here. Any question about compost? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the first question is again. The first question. The first yeah. one is. Uh, uh, this is the compost pala, yeah. After yeah. the compost is ready, we we keep it here as we transfer it to the. Yeah, to the, the field. To the field. Yeah. Um, in the process of keeping it in the pala, we know that it contains nutrients which are very volatile when subjected to some heat. Yes. So, um, what is the right 
recommendation to keep it in the palace so as not to well, evaporate, the nutrients okay. evaporate. That's one. Yeah. And secondly, um, uh, for the compost to be applied in the field, what is the ratio that you mix with the soil? The soil and compost ratio. Okay. Yeah. Okay. For the first question, <laughs> the best way to uh, take the advantage of the nitrogen that is there and is not evaporated to the air, you make your calculation. If you are going to plant on January, it means you are going to prepare the field on December, make the compost on, start to make it on uh, August, so it will be ready the end of November. <coughs> On December, you just bring it to the field as it's ready, as fast as you can, so less nitrogen will disappear, one way. Second way, if you keep it covered by plastic, for example, you keep the nitrogen inside, it, don't let it evaporate it. And uh, usually the big companies, not like here, make the compost in closed buildings and also they add some other minerals some more nitrogen some more uh, potassium some, some more to enrich the compost so yes you are you are losing some of the nitrogen but also when you put nitrogen on the soil anyway by the irrigation after a while part of it evaporated and the plant is not actually if you make the right calculation you will see that about 30 percent of the minerals that you give to the plants by the irrigation or by the other way are used by the plant because the left is drain and go away and you lose but you prefer to give more then the plant will not have uh, deficiency of something then to give the right amount and part of it will disappear okay this is for the first question now the ratio uh, mostly depends what you grow if you grow watermelon you put different amount if you grow tomatoes so it depends on the crop secondly it depends on what kind of soil if you have uh, heavy soil, you have to put more. If you have light soil, you have to put less. Usually we put between 20 to 30 cubic meter uh, compost per hectare. More or less. Depends. If it's a watermelon or, or, or cereal or, or uh, potatoes, it's about 30 cubic meter per hectare. If it's a very other vegetables like tomatoes, like pepper, like a carrot, you enough protein. Okay? Another question? More questions? So let's continue. First of all, no, no, that's in all the who are teaching all the who are Colombian. They are teaching long which for more than ever. China. That's in all the who are. นี่ก็เจ้าเนาะเจนมูนี่ตะลุจีตัวนี่มันม่วงลงแล้วน่ะกายกายตัวเจนเนาะเนาะเราหูรีว่าคอลัมบีเนาะเนาะนุ่มเ
covered in by plastic. And you can see that if we uh, uh, look at the plastic, it's two colors plastic. On the bottom, it's black. You see, here it's black, and at the top, it's yellow. Can you think about the idea why they use this kind of plastic? Yeah. Yellow, but. Insects, flies, yes, yes. Not to pick the wall. Uh, this is a, a common mistake that uh, the opposite. The black is, is cooling the, the, the soil and not, uh, it's preventing, it's preventing the weeds to grow because it makes darkness and plant without, without light cannot develop. So they make darkness on the on the surface of the soil, so weeds cannot go up. Now they make these holes because here they are going to plant the crop, and the crop needs to see the light. So they have to make these holes, and they will plant here. They plant, and uh, the surrounding the plant will not, will, will uh, grow without weeds and no for less competition with the weeds and the crop can go much better and the yellow it's it's white to uh, it, uh, attract the kind of insects not only the insects attracted to the yellow but the, the very problematic fly here are the flies of the white fly the Bermesia that uh, bringing the viruses so uh, this, they are attracted to the yellow, so they use the yellow the plastic. Now, what is this? This is a trellis. They grow here cucumber, melon, watermelon, or any crop that need that needs a heavy trellis trellis. So they 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 go they they hang it on the this net and uh, the end of season you can find the watermelon in this size hanging on this uh, net but if, if they let it go on the floor it's a natural way to the cucumber melon watermelon to grow to go is on the floor first of all the fruits will touch the soil and will be exposed to more diseases and problems and secondly uh, it will cover it will, it will cover the, 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 the soil and will not have enough place to grow with exposed to the sun sunlight so the growing this way it has more area to develop and to be exposed to the sunlight so it can grow much better much faster better fruits and the fruits will be in the air that are not touch the soil are less exposed to any other problems so uh, mostly they go here i think a uh, can melon watermelon cucumber uh, beans uh, many kinds of beans soya beans uh, peas etc etc question what kind of trellising is this? Is it the Spanish? This Spanish? Is, no, this is Spanish. This is a Dutch. Dutch trellising. The Spanish is a, Maybe we'll see it later. Okay. It's two... Uh, it's two... Uh, metals or, or wood. Uh, and, and, and the plants go this way. They are, they are most, uh, less popular. Because the vegetable farmers, they use the same irrigation system of the vegetables, and, and because it's too little, they put two lines of the water instead of two. My vineyard, I have one line, 20 millimeter heavy, and uh, each up. No, uh, okay, uh, th th this is, uh, growing grapes is, is something different, uh, because uh, 
first of all, about uh, a look here. This is what they call low tunnel uh, field. Uh, you see these uh, metals, arcs of metal they put, and they cover it. Now, because it's too cold and the plants are too young, you can see there the kolarabi uh, or something. Or, yes, it's kolarabi or, or maybe uh, cauliflower, we don't know yet. Or here also. They still, they're keeping it closed even during the day because they want to raise the temperature inside. And then also the humidity, you can see the, the water here. It's because it's closed. Uh, I believe if you come here next week, then it will be much higher the temperature. During the day, they will remove the plastic. They, they will expose it to the sun. And in the evening, they will close it back. And it's very simple, it's just keeping it from one side, bring it to the other side, and then bring it back. Uh, they are missing here something, they need another, another wire here. They didn't put it yet because just planted, I think, two or three days ago. Very young plants. And you can see here, they have two grape lines. And each line, one from here, one from here, one from here, because the distance between the plant here is about 40 centimeters. It's going to be cauliflower, big plant, big cauliflower, so big distance between the plants. If it was kohlrabi, it was 15 centimeters between the plants. It will be cabbage, the same. It depends where they are going. Are they breathing? The hole no, is almost the same like there, but yeah. here they put a mulching of uh, yellow polyethylene on the bottom uh, yeah. to yeah. prevent weeds yeah. and to uh, yeah. 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 and also uh, and they put a uh, like but look what they're doing here. This is exposed. This is covered. Exposed. Cover, exposed, cover. What the idea? Economically, yes, yes, economically. What, what economically? Yeah. Okay, I don't. May, maybe if, if this is the idea, they mistake because uh, if by this way they get much more product. They will not sell, they will gain more. But yes, it, it's economically, but the idea is like this. They plant about two weeks ago. They plant this plant. And they were covered by... They let it make the first stage of growing. Uh, make a good system and grow. Uh, two weeks ago, and now they are continue growing. The weather became better than two weeks ago, and will be better next week, etc. Et so they can develop now. After delay of three weeks, they plant the plants. In the beginning, because the plants are young, they need help with the plants. They will develop to be this side, they will remove the plastic. And when time comes, they will have, will harvest this rose. Yes. And after two weeks, they will not have product to sell to the market. So to supply continuous of product, they have to plant every two weeks to uh, continue harvesting all the time. This is the idea. So, because if, if I uh, 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 
And I have a contact with the co-op or with the Rami Levy or whatever and to supply for them broccoli, to supply for them the cauliflower. They want me to supply them around all here. And now I have to plan in, in different times so I can supply all the time harvest from other trees. Because of that you see all these crops are in different stages. Each crop will be harvested in different times and when we finish the tour we'll go to the warehouse we see that all the time they are uh, packing different crops to the customers. Okay? Let's continue to the uh, open field in front of the greenhouse. This field, like this. And after it uh, gets big enough, they remove the, the, the plastic and let it grow. They is almost ready to harvest. Maybe tomorrow or the after tomorrow they will harvest. Okay, let's go to What did you mean? Yeah. What are you talking? Oh. Shoot out? Bro. No shoot out. Only shoot out. <laughs> This is the same thing, which is like an Oreo. This one. Oh, 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 this one. Onion? No. No onion. <laughs> you want it? No. No, no. Hey, do you know this beef? Hey, I want. It's a beef. Okay. It's beef. Meat. Okay, this. We... No, no, it's not spicy. We uh, eat it. It's cooked in the, in the soup, usually. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's called arum or beef, depending on. It's kind of. Uh, we, we eat the steam and, and, and the, the steam from here to here. It's, it's not. It's not the like. It's not like an onion that have. Uh, <coughs> Smells like a little bit, little bit. Okay, it's garlic. Let's open the side. 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 Shout out to no, yeah, like your strawberry. Here, just done. Then just honey pot, then no. That's no, pay that to do a share. Let what done, then no. Then no, just sit down. Then no, I'm prepared. Then yeah, let what done, yeah, only just do it. Then no, just be sure to move no, okay. Also the garlic. It's grown by drip irrigation system, and here you see something interesting. Come on, move. One row of garlic, two lines garlic. of water, of the drip irrigation system. The other one, one. Why this is different? Because garlic, the way that we go with garlic, 
Uh, the first stage we go in is the uh, amount of water. The this stage, after lowering, we have to give much more water for very short period. No, no, no. So instead of uh, because they have to irrigate all this fish and they don't have enough time to learn to make the, the, the uh, irrigation you gotta, you gotta... time for this field longer <laughs> they don't have enough time to give it longer than during every day they prefer to put more drip ice in the field to get more water in the short time <laughs> then, otherwise they cannot supply enough food to the every day so sometimes they make the irrigation time longer, <laughs> normal feed, but if they don't have time, we have any 24 hours a day, the amount of water that comes in the main system is limited, so they can irrigate such and such amount of water. If they want to add, they have to uh, add more drippers to the field, so they make the irrigation time shorter, now, when the gar garlic is grown <laughs> enough, they will stop the irrigation, let it dry. This part will develop and be like this. Why not intercrop it? Thay thế nào chịu nhưng mà chịu đừng có một chịu này cháu cho nó đun lên luôn khác nha 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 rồi nha anh ta sẽ bố lú sao cô dịch thoát luôn à chỉ thoát thoát nha sẽ để lá nữa they close all the second part of the water only on the valley or so it's kind of intercropping by twice yeah because they can control each one as as they want. And this is the idea that I think it's because if you can control all the water Come to Sakai, I pop for the Archie, you might just run the line. And the LED boys pay for the lab. Shock. Tor, 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 Ừ, giờ tụi ý rồi, vậy nó giờ Cho nó dễ chặt tổ nó, cho nó nè Chặt tổ nó tự cứ kia nè, bỏ cho biết một xe chặt tổ nó This is a very very short time what we now you know we have a holiday Passover it's uh, next month something like this and we used to eat this dish with the two of it in the religious holiday and they grow it for a very short time we holiday market for one, two, three weeks so <laughs> nó giờ tấu đó giờ nó chỉ tấu nó
Squash, pumpkin. This is squash, pumpkin. Not pumpkin, squash. Squash. Uh, zucchini or other squash. Now they go it. They go it for the squash, for the or for the flowers. Sometimes yeah. the flowers are very are very uh, popular crop. Uh, you see that no, there are no much flowers, but they are very expensive and. Uh, Use it for decoration or salads in gourmet restaurant, and it costs a lot of money. But also the course, the squash itself, it's very it's very good and very nice. Uh, and you can see that the idea is the the normal the regular squash grow yes. on the on the on the floor it's on the ground. Here the trellis it. So they can have much more flowers, much more fruit, and much cleaner uh, uh, crop. Uh. All the crops that we have seen, they harvest it, they pick it when it's ready, and they bring it to this packing house. In this packing house, they are sorting, cleaning, and pack it, and make, you see here, the boxes, each boxes for special customer according to his order. They order some of this and that and this and they pack it for them and from here they deliver to the customer. I want I want you to go in the listen listen speed. Because they are working now Follow <laughs> Follow me, follow me. This is the sorting machine.
नहीं अच्छे से I'm missing. Yeah. You are missing. Okay. Okay. Any questions? No. For all this day. If not, go to the bar. And we are going back to the. Yes. Should be back.